problem three. Aries multiplies two integers which differ by nine. Grace multiplies two integers which differ by six. They obtain the same product, t. Determine all possible values of t. In some ways, this question is a little more familiar than the others. If we look at solving this by algebra and let Aries first number be a and his second a minus nine, and Grace's numbers be g and g minus 6, then we can set up an equation for the product. We have a times a minus 9 equals g times g minus 6. It might be a good idea to consider completing the square, and then I would get a minus 9 over 2 squared minus 81 over 4 is g minus 3 squared minus 9. Now I really don't like fractions. So I'm going to multiply everything by 4 and I get 2a minus 9 squared minus 2g minus 6 squared equals 45. Now this looks as if we might be getting somewhere interesting because this is Aries' two numbers added together and this is Grace's two numbers added together. So let's look at what we might do with that. So now we have the sum of Aries' numbers squared minus the sum of Grace's numbers squared. And I've just let this be a and g to make life simpler. The answer to that is 45. Now this factorises into a minus g, a plus g equals 45. So we're looking for two numbers which multiply together to make 45. Now there are many of these, for example, 10 and 4.5 or 18 and two and a half. But in this question, we are only interested in integers, so that makes life much easier. Now, we mustn't forget that we have negative integers as well as positive integers, and so we can see that the factors of 45 are plus or minus 1 paired with plus or minus 45, plus or minus 3 paired with plus or minus 15, and plus or minus 9 paired with plus or minus 5. So if we consider the case with 1 and 45 to begin with, we see that we have four equations to solve. And they give us quite a nice solution where we see that a can only be plus or minus 23 and g can only be plus or minus 12. So let's look at the other two cases now and we should then have a complete solution to the problem. So when then we consider the 3 and the 15, and the 9 and the 5, we see that we have six possibilities. A, having these six possibilities, and we check because capital A was the sum of Aries' two numbers. Here is his first and his second number, and these all work. And we see that there is three solutions to this problem. The product is 112, 0, or negative 8. And lastly, we want to check that Grace's numbers actually exist. And when we go through the same equations, we get this table here for Grace, and we see we get the same product, 112, 0, and negative 8. There are three solutions to this problem.